The Cambridgeshire property market remained busy in September despite a turbulent month. It's somewhat unbelievable the amount of headlines we've seen over the course of September. The sad news of Queen Elizabeth II passing, a new Prime Minister with her controversial mini-budget, interest rates increasing and the pound falling against the dollar. A lot of people are interested to know how this and the cost of living crisis has affected the housing market in Cambridgeshire. Despite a lot of doom and gloom from the media, September was actually an extremely busy month for Ellis Winters. Across our three branches, we listed 61 new properties for sale. That was our highest new listing month so far in 2022. Sales were also a similar story, with 41 sales agreed. Our second best performing month so far this year. So despite all the negative news, it is clear that people are still motivated to buy and sell a property in Cambridgeshire. The pricing of available property has been impacted recently. Across the area of Cambridgeshire that we operate, there were 105 price reductions by other estate agents in September. That's compared to 71 in August. In some cases, these agents have reduced the price of half of their available stock in September. This is something that potential sellers should be wary of when selecting an agent to market their home. Whilst prices are not falling, it's important to consider your asking price carefully. At Ellis Winters, we follow a marketing process that ensures our clients the best chances of selling at the best selling price. This is reflected in the low number of price reductions Ellis Winters carry out and the high number of property sales. If you are thinking of moving, speak to Ellis Winters today about how we can maximise the value of your home and help you with your move. Thank you for watching.